everybody, this is Tambi and I'm back with another Transformers video review. This time I have the Combiner Wars Devastator. This is actually going to be video number six. The most controversial figure in this whole lot, Mixmaster. Uh, which actually his front is on this side, so not this side. Um, Alright, so you may be saying, uh, what's wrong with this guy? Uh, this is all backwards. I guess Hasbro decided to take it upon themselves, and I don't know if uh, this is how they're portraying him in IDW. Not really sure. I haven't got to the Combiner War series yet. Um, but Hasbro decided to go ahead and make Miss Mixmaster a a very rare dump truck or or cement truck, not a dump truck, a cement truck, uh, and it's a front loading cement truck or a front dumping cement truck where the front is up here and then it comes out right here um, usually this is a little bit further out but uh, and this is the engine that then turns the barrel I think they're a little bit larger I think they're meant for large construction uh, but people still use regular dump truck or regular cement trucks so I don't really know why they did this and then they ended up making this really small so his foot looks a little odd so I am glad that repro not leap or April that uh, dr. Wu is making a um, attachment for this to actually fix it uh, there is another company oh gosh who is it that's making it they're actually making a, um, a new mix master for uh, for this guy so I don't think I'm gonna be getting that that's just not something that I'm really uh, worried about too much I think if somebody decides to go ahead and make a hook for the leg and then a um, a prowl for the body section, I might get that. Uh, and that's the only other add-on than the, uh, the the Dr. Wu ones that are uh, coming with the guns and then uh, the uh, the fixes for the hands. And my mistake, it's not Dr. Wu that's making those, it's Perfect Effect. Dr. Wu is actually making the uh, the replacement mix master so that's who's making those if you're looking into those so it's perfect effect that's making the add-ons and Dr. Wu that's making the totally new guy well, let's go ahead and transform this guy um, he uh, yeah okay well um, alright so first thing we're gonna go ahead and do this uh, you take this and flip this out and that is his head right there so you got that um, so then you come down to here you want to pull these arms apart because it's they're kind of attached to his leg and I guess I'll go ahead and bring them all the way out um, just so that they're where they need to be and then you take and disconnect come on from here and you take and pull that like that and then you, you go like that and he's done uh, you bend the elbows and yeah it's um kind of a quick transformation uh, I'm gonna say that he probably has one of my favorite heads though uh, his head is is really nice it's uh it's very uh it, it's very much a almost a Decepticon symbol almost a lot like <clears throat> sound waves so where it has that little crest right there and, and such but oh you can't even see it um, I'm kidding let me go ahead and bring this up. So yeah, there's his head. Um, as I was saying before, with a little crest and such. So there you go. So uh, for his articulation, you got extra stuff right there. Articulation again. Um, head, you can, can. It looks like it's a ball joint, so you can move it up and down. It's just really hindered by this stuff that's going all around him. So you can see that his head does go in and out, but you can't really see that. Uh, it does turn left and right. Uh, which is nice. Then you come here to the arms. There's two different joints. So there's a joint to move it forward and back, and then there's another pin joint to move it out. It gets pretty hindered because of all this stuff, and then this stuff right here. Elbow joint, and that's about it. You come down here to the hips. So you got a joint for forward and back motion, and then you got another joint for outwards, and then you have your twisty thing right here. You have your knee, and then you have a tilt right here for this so that's about it on that guy um, 
so you know once again uh, I, I believe that this was put a little bit too far down that it should have been somehow incorporated into this wheel right here uh, and I think that would have been a little bit a little bit better um, I don't exactly know but I think that they probably could have found some way to incorporate it into there and, and make the arm proportionate um, and then it's really weird because I always want to use this as the front part of the legs because this looks more like a, a good thing for the front part of the legs other than this because you don't look like you have like any feet real here just because of all this but you know if you look at this this looks like a foot um, instead of but more of a uh, heel support I guess they do that because of the the mixing barrel on the back you would probably tip over if you didn't have that in there but oh well All right, so we'll go ahead and leave it at that for Mixmaster. Don't forget to check out my other Devastator videos. We got one more, the combined video. Don't forget to subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. This has been Tambiota, and I'll see you next time.